you don't have to study sociology before coming to study at York. Um, I never studied sociology before and first year just gets you at the same level as everybody else. So you're not actually at a disadvantage if you've never studied it before. So the difference between a lecture and a seminar is that a lecture is often in um, a lecture theatre and it's much bigger. Um, and the lecturer talks to a group, it could be up to 100 or 200 people. A seminar is a smaller group of between about 12 and 15 people where you get together with a seminar leader and you discuss a piece of work that you might have been reading or a topic of that week. And it's just more informal and you can just get your ideas out on the table and discuss it. The jump from school to university can be felt differently by different people. I think the main difference is the level of independence that we have here at university. Obviously, most people are living away from home, there's that aspect to it, but also less um, contact hours means more time to yourself, essentially, which you have to prioritise what you're going to do. So, you know, you have to allocate times to study and also go out and see friends and also do things that you're interested in, for example, societies or sports or something. So the great thing with sociology at York um, is when you get to sort of that third year of your degree, everything is like very open to your interpretation and you can sort of go where you want to and make sure you're really like researching topics that you're interested in. Um, like with my modules, um, they very much sort of say to you now, the lecturers, it's, you know, if you think of a question that's not on our list, um, then come and see me and we can come up with a question together that's more tailored to what you want to do because they want you to be writing something that you're actually interested in. Um, and that's definitely really good with when it sort of comes to the dissertation as well. In this department, you can do your dissertation on pretty much anything you want as long as you can get it past ethics. So obviously, because I am really interested in sort of food and food buying, um, I'm actually like managing to do my dissertation on sort of food trends and veganism and stuff like that so it is really good in that sense as you can sort of really get involved in stuff that you are then interested in study wise and it doesn't feel as much of a chore to do it. Mm -hmm.